champion battle rapper. He's beaten guys like Unorthodox Phrases, Norman Bates. He got screwed out of a battle against wait, Cortez. Wait. He beat the psycho? I don't understand. Yes, he beat the psycho. <laughs> he beat Norman Bates. There was a rapper that goes around calling himself Norman Bates for no reason, and Complex showed him why he should not do that. Ooh. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Complex. How you doing, sir? What's good, man? Brooklyn, Coney Island building. What's good, man? Nothing much. Nothing much. I'm glad to have you on the show. Thank you. Thank you. I appreciate you having me. Not a problem. Not a problem. So uh, your first mixtape, I heard, I heard like bits and pieces of your first mixtape. You really did a decent job at mixing all that together. Um, so first question I want to ask you about before we get into the battle rapping, which is uh, one of the main reasons why you're here. Um, your 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 flow, your style. What actually got you started in writing music? What actually got you started in doing this whole thing? Um, basically the whole thing that got me started was I, I've always been a hip hop fan. You know what I'm saying? Growing up as a kid, uh, started like uh basically writing rhymes around like 13, 14 years old, and just kept going from there. I used to bump uh you know everyone like I'm I'm more of an old school cat to be honest, but I used to bump like Mob Deep, Wu Tang, you know a, a lot of old school stuff, and then I started getting into the underground rappers, and I just I'm like a sponge. I absorbed everyone and just, you know, just put everything together and came up with my own style, I guess you could say. All right, that sounds good. That sounds good. So um, what was the title of your uh, first mixtape, if uh, anybody wants to actually go out there and pick it up, get it on iTunes or whatever else? Um, the first mixtape I had dropped was uh, called uh, Musical Imbalance Volume 1, and that was uh, featuring my man Tiamu Denko at the time, and that was, that's, that's when I was real young. So, um, yeah, Musical Imbalance Volume 1, it had uh, drops from, like, Immortal Technique on there, um, mm -hmm. Solstice, Awkwards, Couple Cats, you know what I'm saying, Bow Rat, and just a lot of collabs, so it was, like, more of a collaboration mixtape. All right, and uh, I know you have a second one out there. Uh, the second one um, I'm working on, actually, is uh, Revelations. That's coming out, and I'm working on one called Why You Mad, Volume 1. That's, that's almost done, you know what I'm saying, with, like, 20 tracks deep. I'm trying to get, like, two more tracks on that. All right, oh, so... By the way, when Complex releases music, he's not gonna release like a ten song album like your typical rap. He's gonna he's gonna throw <laughs> a lot of material at you. Yeah, yeah, definitely, man. So um now what's the uh what's the drive? What's the uh what's the stuff behind the music? You know, what what gets you going when you actually start writing this what what actually got you going when you started writing this new mixtape, when you started writing the rhymes and getting the beats together? By the way, also who's responsible for the beats on your tracks or whatever else? Oh uh, well I have like a lot of producers that just uh throw me stuff, you know what I'm saying? Cause the the, the buzz that I have right now and stuff, so um they're just throwing me beats all the time. I I, I rock a lot of just uh mainstream instrumentals and stuff underground instrumentals but there's a lot of talented producers that just uh you know throw stuff my way all the time actually my brother produces as well he goes by highlight beats and uh he he, he produces a lot of stuff for me too especially like the singles that i got uh one of the singles is why you mad and uh y'all be playing that later a little later in the show so all right yeah. that sounds good that sounds good uh um, oh, all right full fact has got something for you all right you work with anybody in the business right now uh in the business right now well uh, uh like uh, i've been on freestyle friday a couple times and i made a uh, Connects off the 106 in Park, like uh, I mess with uh, like I said, uh, Poison Pen from Grind Time. He he's the president now for the East Coast Division, but uh, me and him are good peoples. Um, I actually uh talk to Lady Luck, uh, Cassidy, Iron Solomon, like the all my all my peoples, real close friends. You know what I'm saying? But um, I got collabs coming out with uh a lot of those people in the future. Hopefully, we'll see what's going on with that. So you know. All right, that sounds cool. Now let's move into your uh, battle rap career. The first one that I think really got you onto the map is when you took Orthodox phrases and spanked him in the middle of this really <laughs> dark brown room. He's talking about Jupiter's moon and a fruit of the loom and like making no sense when he was spitting, and then you just went in and took him out. So uh, how would how, how did it how did it go when you first? battled unorthodox phrases when you got in front of a like who was widely considered a grind time boss well um with the unorthodox phrases uh at the time like the east coast division was just starting up and um basically uh i was definitely one of the top dogs at the time you know what i'm saying and um basically unorthodox phrases he was in the florida division and uh he was the top dog for his division he was killing he was killing it down there just you know just murdering dudes so uh, except for lush one yeah except for lush one yeah <laughs> but uh yeah he was murdering dudes down there you know what i'm saying he was definitely top tier in his division and um uh, at the time, with that battle, uh, that battle happened with Jay's Juice when he was president for Grind Time. Shouts out to Jay's and all them. Shouts out to Phrases too. Um, so you know we made the calls and Phrases flew, uh, flew down here and stuff, and 
we just got it on, man. We just hopped in the ring and, you know what I'm saying, just went at each other. Pause, you know what I'm saying? Went at each other. <laughs> but, um, yeah, that's man. That's a word that's frequently used on this show. Yeah, yeah, pause. We just went at each other and, um, yeah, man, it made a classic battle once to OT and I took it in OT, so it was definitely a classic, man. And uh, Frazier's is a dope dude after the battle of Soul Love. He was just really humble, a really cool person, man, so, yeah. Now, my question is, um, now, when you were in Orthodox races, you were going you were going about round for round. You you guys were cutting even. Did you feel slighted when our Orthodox races was not prepared for an OT round? Uh, yeah, I actually knew he wasn't prepared for OT because uh, you could just kind of tell when someone just goes into the freestyle format instead of the written format. So um, as soon as that OT came in and I heard the first word that came out of his mouth, I knew that wasn't planned, you know, as a written. So I knew I was going to take him on that, you know what I'm saying? But his freestyle skills is dope, though. Like, don't sleep on him, you know what I'm saying? I have a question that I want to ask. Yeah. The question is like, not a lot of people going to ask this, but what's your record as a battle rapper? Oh, man. I don't even know my record, to be honest. I got losses, I got wins, you know what I'm saying? Not the, I got so many battles that I've had that's been off camera, you know what I'm saying, that I just completely murdered people. And But, like, on camera, I, you know, I got losses here and there, but, like, I got battles with, like, on YouTube that's not even with Grind Time. So, ah, man, it's just so many battles. I don't even know, man. But I know I got more wins than losses altogether. <laughs> well, of course, otherwise, uh, Smack wouldn't take you then. Uh, Klaus, you got something for him? Well, no, no, no. It's it's better to have more wins than losses. That pretty much makes sense to me. This guy got the best voice, man. <laughs> well, the, well, I thank you. <laughs> a lot of us just uh, attribute it to glue huffing and drinking. Well, I mean, once you hit three packs a day, it just comes with it. It's an extra special <laughs> prize. <laughs> All right, so um, now, how did, now, okay, first off, I do want to mention this. This is actually one of your quote-unquote losses. I can't believe Iron Silent actually gave that to gave that to this man, but um, your battle with Cortez, yeah. this was, um, I believe, widely debated as, like, you know, some sort of controversial loss for you because, uh, well, Cortez fought the last round is if you watch the battle, it's on YouTube. Um, Cortez didn't rap for, like, the last 30 seconds, got choked up in his verse and then all of a sudden instead of it being an automatic loss for Cortez like it would be in a lot of other leagues um, it went to OT and Cortez had a chance to fight back at that um, how did you take that loss that loss to Cortez the one that um, you supposedly lost but um, in all honesty what did you think of Cortez because um, especially when um, it went to OT you just went like I saw you on camera you were just doing this whole book thing like written 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 mm. Um, well, at the time, like that was that was my that was the first grind time East Coast battle. That was my first grind time battle ever, and um, you know what I'm saying. So like, I felt like I put on a great performance, you know, for that time, and I thought Cortez really did his thing too. I mean, at, at the time, the third round when he choked, though, you know what I'm saying. I go by like if you choke and don't rap for like 20 seconds, 30 seconds, whatever, I consider that in my book an automatic loss. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people's book. Yeah, but um. I mean, I guess, like, they felt he had stronger lines in some parts, and you know what I'm saying? I had stronger lines in different parts, so they sent it to OT, but you know what I'm saying? I think it was a classic battle that, that kind of set, like, the standards for, like, the East Coast division and, and what we was doing at the time, you know what I'm saying? Uh, a lot of people still debate and watch that battle today, so, you know what I'm saying? It's no 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 hate or anything. Cortez is definitely cool people. He's one of my dudes, so. All right, cool. Yeah. All right, so. Who, who you give the most respect to as a, as a battle rapper, other than yourself? Because obviously you're gonna rate yourself as the best. And I mean, but who else would you say is like really up there, top top five? Oh man, there's a lot, man. I, I don't, I don't even have a top five. Like, there's just so many rappers that are so talented, and especially for battling like Grind Time and Smack, and just like even dudes in the past like Murder Mook and Loaded Lux. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, Loaded Lux is someone I think is definitely up there. Um, Solomon's up there, you know what I'm saying? But, like, there's a lot of up-and-comers that is just dope, like Hollow, like Cortez, I consider up there. There's a lot of people that's up there, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't really have a top five, man, to be honest. All right, so um, now you are battling in a um, URL TV smack battle coming up March 26th, I believe? Uh, yeah, March 26th. Um, now, who is that against? Uh, it's this guy Ray from Detroit. Uh, supposedly he runs with like uh, X Factor and Young Miles, so should be a really good battle, man. 
All right, so um, how did this uh, whole uh, Smack URL thing come about? I mean, because not a lot of rappers actually get to go in front of the Smack camera. They're very exclusive with what they do. So um, how did that whole how did that whole thing with Smack it worked out? Uh, well, basically, my man Jay's Juice, like I said, the former Grand Time president, uh, he's kind of starting his own little league or whatever uh, out in Yonkers. And um, basically, um, Jay's has been cool peoples with me since the beginning. So uh, I battled for him on the spot, had this blind battle with me versus Osiris. And uh, Norbs, uh, who uh, works with Smack and uh, deals with URL, was there. And he was one of the judges. And we just uh, clicked, you know what I'm saying? Pause again. <laughs> we right. just clicked. But um, yeah, basically, yo, he was really cool people. He liked what I was doing. I, I, I murdered the dude that was there. And, you know what I'm saying? From there, it was just history. He told me to come through for the 26th, told me who, I, uh, who to battle. And, yeah. All right, so um, now when it comes to this battle against Rainy in Detroit, I know you don't want to like give away too much of your stuff, but um, you got some fire prepared for him. Oh yeah, we got bars, man. We got bars for days, man. Oh well, three minute rounds, you know what I'm saying? So I, I get to really just go off, you know. It's not a grind time format. Grind time is more like sixty seconds, you know what I'm saying? Minute rounds and just with URL is completely different so I'm just gonna go off three minutes so I can really like show off my skills and versatility you know what I'm saying yeah cause a lot of people they get into the smack arena off of grind time and then they kind of they kind of fumble they kind of they kind of flow they don't flow very well like you know for example Hollow the Dawn's first uh Smack battle, he kind of like it, it was kind of like stop and go, stop and go. It was like press and play and press and repeat on certain things. Um, I don't know. I think the only reason why he had that because he had so much crowd reaction. You know what I'm saying? Maybe maybe that's why he had to stop. You know what I'm saying? But I think Hollow's a beast. You know what I'm saying? Well, so, yeah, Hollow the Dawn is yeah. a beast. I mean, like you saw what he did at Awkward's about what a couple <laughs> months ago. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not getting involved in it. Those are both my people. So <laughs> you hey, know what I'm saying? Hey, you know what though? You got. Hey, I take a look at things objectively. I think Hollow killed him. Um, <laughs> Awkward's is all right. Awkward's is all right. But do you know what though? When you lose the T Rex, I'm sorry. I mean, yo, T Rex kind of beasted in that battle. Though. I can't front. You know what I'm saying? T Rex. T Rex is dope, man. So, um, what would you think you'd do in a battle with T Rex? I mean, I think I go at T Rex's head, man. Like it'd be a rap, man. I try any. It don't matter who I battle. I'm always gonna try to go at the head. You know what I'm saying? All right. So, um, now you you think grind time or smack fits your uh, style better? Oh man, it's just I adjust really well to like whatever. You know what I'm saying? Like with grind time, I adjust it to the more um, comedic value that they have. You know what I'm saying? And you know what I'm saying? I just try to adapt to whatever. So. But I feel like I, I lean more towards a, a URL style because that's that's what I started with, like you know, just hard, witty punchlines. And I wasn't really a comedy rapper until I got into grind time. So, but you know, what I'm saying it, it was a learning experience. So I'm glad that I did the grind time and everything. And I'm glad that like you know I'm about to do a URL. So it's a good look. You know what I'm saying? All right, all right. So um, now before we get into your first track that you're gonna play for us, um, what do you think was the best battle rap in history? Best battle rapper, you said. Best battle rap. Best best battle. Oh man. I want to. I want to like you know like. Like wanna mainstream battles, or are we talking like underground battles? Underground, mainstream, combine it all up and throw it all together. I don't care if Matter it's fact, school jam. Two part. Make that a two part question. <laughs> I want. I want. Also want to know who in the industry, like mainstream industry, you think could be like a battle rapper. Uh, well, yo, before I even came to the station today, I was I was watching uh the the whole LL Cool J and uh, Cannabis. Uh, battle. I think that's a classic battle to go down in history. Like, you know what I'm saying? Cannabis and LL and even like uh, Jay-Z and Nas, man, when they was going at it, that was, cla uh, that was crazy, man. Like, you know what I'm saying? For like mainstream artists and underground, man, there's so many battles, man. There's so many classics like Solomon versus, um, what was it, E. Ness and like... Just, oh, wow. That just, whole yeah. getting beat by a Jewish guy line. That was the best. I think it was the best line I ever heard. Yeah, man. Uh, that, that battle was crazy. A lot of hollow battles is Classic, loaded Lux battles, Mook battles, there's so many classics out there, man. A lot of people say, like, the Mook versus Sirius Jones battle was probably one of the most classic in the... Yeah, uh, yeah definitely, man. That, that battle was crazy. All right, so um, I want you to describe that first track that we're about to play. Full Fact is going to get it loaded up. Um, Mad Men, right? Uh, nah, the first track we got coming up, I think, is uh, uh, I'll Be Killing Him. It's a remix to the Fabulous song that's out right now. And, yeah, it's featuring mm -hmm. Tiff, so... All right. Yeah. So um, now, um, when you when you decided to take this fabulous beat and do something with it, um, what was your what was your um, what was your mindset when you were spitting those lyrics? I just thought the beat was hot, man. To be honest, like the beat was fire, and I just wanted to you know do my own little twist to it. So that's that's basically it. You know what I'm saying? 
All right, so um, Be Killing Them Remix with Complex is coming up right now. This is Rated R Radio. You got questions for Complex, you want to talk to him? 718-951-4444. Full fact, let's get it going. Killing him beat. Whoa. That was that was some fire right there, man. That was some fire right there. So uh I, I, that was that was that was some amazing stuff, bro. Thank you, I appreciate that man for real. Appreciate right. the love. Not a problem, not a problem, not a problem. And by the way, I don't BS when I I don't BS when I show rappers love because like you have no idea how many people coming through here <laughs> trying to talk like, oh I'm I'm a rapper, I'm this, I'm that, like I'm some sort of big I'm a rapper, so what are you saying, son? I'm a rapper. <laughs> yeah, can you rap like that? I could try. All right. There's a difference between trying and succeeding. There's a difference between losing and winning. I'm a winner at losing. What about that? All right, sure. <laughs> you a club bully? Stick to the tables, man. <laughs> All right. So um, now, full factor. Spin it out real quick. Spin it out real quick. Just like cu- cut it, cut it, cut the music. Uh-oh. All right. Uh oh. Oh yeah. <laughs> uh oh is right. Uh oh is right because. What we're going to do right now, you see, we, I told you we were coming in here for a nice little interview, a little MC challenge. See, now, here's the MC challenge part of this whole deal. Whenever I bring a rapper in here, I've done this to just about every single um, hip-hop artist that has come through that has said that they could spit fire and all this other garbage. That everybody talks all this stuff, right? So what I do is... I like to separate. I like to separate, like you know, the good from the bad, the weed, the like the weeds from the chaff, all that other stuff. I want to. I want to make. I want to make sure that you are ready <laughs> for a smack. I want to make sure you're ready for URL. <laughs> now I heard you've done some things in EO Dub. Yeah, yeah, definitely, man. EO Dub ended the week all day, man. All right, so um, you have won their MC challenges before? Uh, no, I haven't won an MC challenge. I only did like two of them, and um. The competition was crazy, so uh, uh, but it was. Uh, it's, it's not really about like winning with EO Dub. It's just like a whole MC challenge. They don't really like go all out and pick a like. They do pick a winner, but you know what I'm saying. It's just all love, basically. Like it's just five rounds of freestyle and everything, and you know what I'm saying. It's just you know about it goes by crowd or uh, participation and applause and all that. So, but I've right. definitely placed up there though. You know what I'm saying. Oh, good stuff. Good yeah. stuff. All right then. So um, now here's the deal. I will explain to you what you're going to be doing round by round. We've spoken about it a little bit before, but I just want to remind the Rated R Radio listeners. Now, first off, he will be Complex will be the 14th person to take this challenge. So far, only two have actually made it through. Because we say, like, you know, rules are no cursing. If you curse immediately, you are, you are done. So uh, we got to keep it clean. We got to keep it fresh. We got to keep it good. No flubbing up. No messing up. This is going to be like what you thought with the Cortex, with the Cortez battle. You, <laughs> you, you stop, you're done. Uh, no doubt. We don't, we don't mess around around here. Okay. Now, it, the limit is 30 seconds on the first round. But if you wish to keep on spitting, that's up to you. Mm-hmm. So what we're going to do is now, you say you're up Coney Island, right? Oh, uh, yeah. Brooklyn, Coney Island all day. Strong Island now. You know what I'm saying? All right. So um, you come up straight for Brooklyn. So, uh, yeah, you got to do it well. You got to do it well in your home borough. All right. All right. So uh, now, full factor. Wh- wh- what have you selected for this uh, man's first beat for this uh, MC challenge? What have you selected? What's the first thing that you're going to throw at this man? You know what? I'm going to let him do a little bit of South flavor right now. So I definitely <laughs> want to hear you on the South tip. You know what I mean? All right. All right, so um, now, round one of the Rated R Radio MC Challenge. This makes or breaks careers, ladies and gentlemen. People have walked out of these studios in tears, man. I'm not even kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not even joking. Nah, no tears over here, man. <laughs> All right, full factor, complex, let's go. All right. All right, yeah, yeah, listen. Uh, it's like this, man. Check. 
check, yo Rappers swearing they hot, but they hate me, yo I represent hard body, Brooklyn Radio We get it popping off of the top of the noggin Dudes thinking that they dope, but they not even rocking Freestyle off of the top I murdered an orthodox and I kill clats right on they block Thinking that you dopeness, you can't even hold this My flow is sick, son, and I'm so ferocious Got the toasters, you got the tech nine I'm so damn dope, I got the best rhymes Try to battle me, better change your strategy I tell you right now, that's straight up blasphemy I be gripping the weapon, it's Smith in the West And I be killing the session and I'm ripping in seconds I be ripping it, ripping it, infinite, sick and ridiculous Sick and syphilis on the tip of a clitoris, yeah 30 seconds And he just, whoa, Klaus, what do you thought of that? I think I just had an aneurysm out of love <laughs> I really did A love aneurysm right there Aneurysm, man yeah. That's the word of the day. That's a word of the day, definitely. <laughs> of course, of course. Yeah, that, that, that's the sound of Klaus's brain exploding or what's <laughs> left of it. Yeah, well, after the glue, the, <laughs> the smoking, the drinking, yeah, I don't have much of a mind left, but don't let that stop you from being amazed that it just exploded. <laughs> yeah, I, it kind of amazes me every day how many brain cells he can still have left to actually kill. <laughs> I, I, I can't actually count them. I don't know how to count anymore. Mm. But there are a few, I think. <laughs> well, we don't, well, he he can actually still think. This is actually a good sign. But um, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna move directly into uh, round two of the challenge. All right. So now this round is 45 seconds. Okay. At least. Once again, you can go further if you wish. All right. Full factor. How many uh, different beats are we gonna throw in him in 45 seconds? No, we're gonna give him this one beat. The third round, I'm gonna chop it up real crazy. For oh, this one is being nice. This one I want I want I want you to give me something like like on the West Coast step. This is a classic joint. I want you to like demolish this track right here. <laughs> no mm. doubt. All right, so we're going to give you 45 seconds and now now it's like you got to spit the fire that you spit like what you spit before was fire. You were like going double time on that beat. I want to see how I want to see how long you can go with that kind of style. So um with the double time? Oh yeah, I want to see how long you can go with it. Like you know, oh, you can right. do what you got to do. But um full fact is going to drop the track. Once again, round two, Rated R Radio MC Challenge. Full Factor, drop that track. All right, yeah, yeah, listen. Yo, you hear me? Yeah. Hey, yo. I'm back in the building and I'm killing like a villain So y'all feeling what I'm spitting and I'm dealing with your feeling Drilling all these tracks and I'm killing all these raps Like a million wear a mask and your feelings getting smashed Lyrically my artillery hitting like the ten me Bending me with weaponry mentally for my telepathy Ready with deadly seven Getty machetes With plenty of medis with many semis So every cat the confetti What you know about me? Ripping the mic, I'm gripping it tight Dudes think they dope, I'm lyrically nice Want to battle son? I bring the team up and My throat is dry, drink Aquafina Freestyles all for the top, I got my I sprint cell phone. I grab mics and I spit raps and melt domes. You gotta be kidding. Infinite written. Murdering cats in competition with ammunition. Thinking that you dopeness, you can't even hold this. Rappers think they hot, but I'm so ferocious. You better recognize. Off the top, never memorize. Flow so nice, you better just step to the side. I'll be bringing it, killing the raps though. They think I'm cute, but consider me fat Joe. You gotta be lying. I'm death defying. When I spit these raps, son, these kids is crying. The book and represent her. I break down cats who's repping. Crack bones like Tepkin, the Smith and Wesson. Whoever stepping, think they dope, son. I got the machete straight aiming, bones decaying. Now your flesh ripping apart. I'm grabbing them seeds and I'm ripping their hearts. We in this radio station, cats hesitating. My flow's dope, son. They're straight up blazing, thinking that you nicer. The ghost writer, flow tighter. Oh my god, son, I flow cyphers. Rap style, Ellie, I rep for my city. It's March 9th, son. Rest in peace to Biggie. Let's go. Oh. Whoa. Whoa, that was fire. That was fire. Klaus? That looks, man. I, I take it back. I think there I just had an aneurysm before. <laughs> and before my the left fact you shut up big in a pop beat, son. That's real gangster. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. That's right. Shout out Biggie on a pop beat. So yeah, I gotta say that that definitely earned your second track. Good looks. That man. definitely earned your second track on Boy. being played on the show. So what do we got coming up next from you, uh, Mr. Complex? Uh, this track right here um, is called So Crazy. It's a remix to uh, Fred the Godson's track or whatever. And um, basically it's off the Why You Mad Volume 1 mixtape coming out. So, you know, I brought y'all a sneak peek and everything. So sneak y'all like new... it. Yeah, remix to that. So definitely, yes. man. Sneak peek, new music coming out from Complex. You hear it. You heard it here first on Rated R Radio. I, I just have one single thing to say. 
if that second round only got him to play his second track, he deserves like a back rub or <laughs> I don't know, a pedicure. I don't know. You deserve a day out on the town. Hopefully not from you, though. We no, 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 not from me. <laughs> not from me. <laughs> we go with that, man. <laughs> all right, all right. So, um, yeah, we'll, we'll, we can work that out when the budget gets bigger. Um, so here's the deal. We're going to play the second track, So Crazy, Complex. This is Rated R Radio. Number to call is 718 951 44 44, you want to ask Complex a question, or if you don't want to just listen, mywbcr.com is where we are, 1090 on your AM dial. This is Rated R Radio. Full fact, let's drop it. So crazy, so, so crazy, so crazy, so, so crazy, so crazy, so, so crazy, so crazy, so crazy, so, so crazy, so crazy, so, so crazy. I'm liking this one right off the back, son. Real heavy right now. Let's go. So crazy, so, so crazy, so, so crazy. DJ Full Factor. Plex going loco, texting that Ocho. Shoot like a photo, test me's a no no. Test anyway. Full Factor. Are you ready, sir? Have, ready to switch it up? Yeah, have you have you laid out the battle plan? Now, Complex, you here? Yes, sir. All right, have you laid out the battle plan for Complex? I'm setting it up right now. Give me a minute, because this one's going to be crazy. <laughs> All right, so here's what I'm going to do. You know what? Because Full Fact, Full Fact is like, seriously, he's sitting there. He's working. He's like, what am I going to throw at this guy? He's like, trying to throw me off my game, man. That's yeah, no. Seriously, no, that, that is what we try to do. <laughs> because yeah, get ready for the Bobby Girl song. It's coming. Oh, it's coming. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be surprised. Blade actually threw Gilligan's Island on, at somebody once. Wow. That's oh great. With Gilligan's God, Island. That's didn't. He threw the Gilligan's Island theme at somebody. I'm not even kidding. Like I don't know what to expect. They don't even tell me because they're afraid I like I like clue in clue in the MCs every once in a while, you know. So they're they're afraid of me. They're afraid like yo, I'll spill the beans or whatever else. So my DJs, I just let them take care of that. So um, complex. You know what? I'm I'm gonna let you get a couple of shout outs in before the before the last round. So you want to shout anybody out? Shout your pages out. And stuff oh like yeah, that? definitely, man. Um. First of all, thanks for having me, for real, man. I appreciate the love and everything. Not a problem. Um, shout outs, man. Uh, just check me out on the YouTube. I got a channel in there called uh, Street Rap Now. Um, spelled just like that. And, you know, I post up a lot of videos and songs and stuff like that. You can check that out. I got the Facebook Complex NY, uh, Facebook.com slash Complex NY. Uh, the Twitter is Complex underscore NY. Follow me on Twitter. I'm always updating both of those heavy. Um, and if you need beats, man, sh uh, check out my brother Highlight. He got Highlight Beats. Uh, you can find him on um, my Facebook as well. He's under my friends list uh, as Jason Selick. So definitely peep that out, man. All right, definitely. Oh definitely. yeah, and uh, why you mad? Volume one dropping soon, like a month and a half. Next round time battle. Next round time battle, which yeah. will be. Ho I'm not too sure the date yet, but it's definitely dropping real soon. So I'm gonna keep yo, know, just keep a lookout for that, man. Definitely. Oh, yeah. it got really quiet in the DJ room. Yeah, I think he's ready. I, I'm not. Yo, full fact is just get crazy. The he's quiet a, before the storm. Yeah. <laughs> um. So what are we gonna do? We gonna ease you into? We gonna ease him into it, or are we just gonna kill him? You gonna go right in. Uh, you gonna yeah. go right in. Kill. All right. So um, <laughs> round. Yo, he's, he's hype, man. He's hype. Uh, uh, round three, last round. Rated R MC Battle Challenge. Only two people have done this before. Will Complex be the third? Find out right now. Full factor. Let's go. Yeah. Okay. Listen. 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 Brooklyn. Listen. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yo, yo They say the kid is nice and the homies wildin' I'm from Brooklyn, you know, Coney Island Throw around is no problem I'm like Batman, cause when I got that Batman I be robbing. you better check it And for the record, I'm reckless The type of rapper to snatch the necklace And leave you necklace Beat switching, the kid's illy Rappers thinking they dope step in my city I'm nice, check the most grimy Checks a whole bomb The rest I address, don't try me You think you dope, son, I leave you on the IV Dudes is crazy, son, I'm poison ivy Flows infecting, don't start stepping Got the weapon, the Smith and the Wesson Pretending that you dopely, can't even hold me My shot from long range is just like Kobe Beat switching and they trying to switch it up I'm on my G-Unit tip, son, what the f- 
Let me stop with the cursing, no rehearsing Every time I spit raps, the words dispersing I'm making money, dummy You thinking that you dope? You kinda ugly and your chick is dug funny The facial features, the grim reaper I'm the teacher, bringing death right through your speakers I'm nasty with the flow I be poking holes in the poking nose with a poker flow You better check it, my rap style is reckless You pretending, I don't know why you pretending You start stepping, I got that weapon straight aiming Every time I spray them rounds, your bones decaying Buddy, stop it, my rap style is obnoxious A transformer, you stepping bomb You need the luck of a leprechaun Cause I'm a Decepticon Stepping bomb with both arms drawn Stop lying, I pop iron These cats straight up flying Rappers thinking that they hot, but now they straight up dying My flow is bonkers, Brooklyn back to the Yonkers I'm on my South-ish, you better recognize Off the top, never memorize Death to fire with the sound I'm grabbing these mics and I'm spitting these rounds Yeah, this is why I'm illy These rappers so silly I'm so dope, son, just give me a milli My flow's really just the type that you love When I grab this mic, son, I'm shooting just like a gun Stop it, I can keep on going The Energizer, Bunny Grab mics and take your money You need to stop, you reckless Don't ever test this Cause I'll tell you right now When that text spits, your neck lifts I'm a raw killer My rap style like a chiller I stomp out your whole block My nickname Godzilla I pop off, your block's off Stop lying You ain't a thug or a gangster You never pop the iron The world's poverty struck Through lottery luck Robberies must Cops are corrupt How can we trust Our own government When our own suffering These presidents talk, yo But straight up they just stay stuttering It's like AIDS infects the globe Guns and weapons sold for prices Less than gold It's pest control Privacy taken Tap phones We strap chrome Drugs wooden through map zones Fast forward 2012 Heaven to hell We better rebel I'll tell you right now Sonny's cash just need to excel I go past 45 minutes I'm in it to win it Infinite lyrics Separate your body from his spirit The DJ keeps switching the beat But it's nothing Rappers think they hot They need to stop bluffing I rock with mad cats Who wanna be Bad on me. I want stuff with Anthony Anderson and Cassidy. You can check my YouTube videos. Dudes think they dope, son. They play with Yu-Gi-Oh! Up in the studio, I'm ripping the mic. Dudes thinking that they dope, but I'm spitting it nice. Yeah, I'm gripping the mic, I'm killing the sight. Stop thinking that you better. My flow straight clever. I slam MCs like my name Def Jam Vendetta. I'm a freestyle off of the top. My mind's blown. Thinking that you dope, I got the non chrome blasting. A freestyle assassin. Portable action, throwing javelins. Fire like a dragon. You gotta be crazy. Flow injected with rabies You thinking that you dope, son I might snatch and just steal your baby It's all goody Black mask and a black hoodie Dudes think they dope But they really can't push me Cause you know why your flow is I'm not even gonna say it though I straight grab mics and start spraying flows You wanna battle, son? You pretending I'll tell you right now I'm a galaxy cause I'm epic you better check it, the rap style is nice I hit on the, around just like Mike Tice And I spit flames, boy I think y'all rappers is mad cause your iPods look like Game Boys Oh! <laughs> you Brooklyn, just, man That was like, what, four minutes? We could keep we, going, man No, we're gonna we're gonna give you that You can just put that on your mixtape right there That <laughs> totally, <laughs> yeah. totally fine, we'll give, you, we'll give you the entire thing It's all yours <laughs> Yeah, seriously <laughs> That'll go. That, that should be like the last track right there. You just recorded it. I mean, we could do that, man. We throw it on a mixtape. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> we'll it on just, freestyle. Just, just credit full factor. You, you got it. <laughs> Good yeah, looks, man. I serious, appreciate it. Seriously, seriously, full factor. What'd you think of that? I'm throwing curveballs and he just hitting home runs. I don't know, man. He said he could keep going. He said he could keep going. You want to try that? Man, I'm gonna run out of beats. This guy got balls. That's the first time I've ever heard that in my radio career. A DJ that, running that's out a, of beats. That's a good thing, though. That's a good thing, man. You know what I'm saying? Taking records. Whoa. So all I've got to say is, Whoa. Complex. Yes, sir. You are the third person to pass the Rated R Radio MC Challenge. If you hadn't figured that out by now. Oh, all right. That's what's up. Thank you. <laughs> so appreciate it, man. Congratulations. Thank you, Big Max. Well, well, as, a, as a wiser man once said, first is the worst, second is the best, third is the one with the hairy chest. But <laughs> don't let that stop you. From I think me. I should put that on my mixtape right there. <laughs> <laughs> well, all right. So now this is how it goes down. Um, I've been telling everybody this for a while. Once we get four people that pass the Rated R Rap MC Challenge... 
we are going to put those four in a battle competition right here on the Brooklyn College campus. We're going to get that in. We're going to get that done. Once we get a fourth person, Lord only knows what we're going to be able to find after the complex because uh, I don't know. <laughs> So far, every MC that's won, it just gets better and better. And uh, y'all yeah, making me blush over here, man, for real. <laughs> nah. Oh, he sure. Read, he read I'm red in the face right he now. Yeah, face. he's turning a little red. Just yeah. a little red, y'all. Y'all giving me. Don't get awkward, red man. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get awkward, red. Yeah. Yeah. Shout out, Hot Weezy. Wow. Hey, wow. you real talk, though. That second track that I play for you. Yeah. I'm putting that on my mixtape. Real all right, track. all right. Yeah. Definitely, man. <laughs> That's what's up. That's a fire tune right there, son. Definitely, man. Thank you. I appreciate that, man. For real. Yeah, man. So the deal is this. So once we get a fourth person, I mean, like, if you want, you can send some rappers over here. We could, we could, uh, you know, destroy their careers or put them in the challenge. <laughs> nah, definitely. I'll, I'll make some calls. We get people up here. It's all love, yo. I, I, the station is dope, man. You know what I'm saying? We need more stations like this. So I'll definitely bring Katzy away without a doubt, man. Definitely, definitely. You know, we'll, we'll go to the smack battle. Um, you know, get some Iron Solomons up in here. <laughs> now I have a question. Yes, sir. I ask this about every battle rapper this what would you do if you caught murder mook if i caught murder you blah, blah, blah. If tongue you caught, twisted over here my fault man if you caught murder mook in a battle because a lot of people have been talking like you know they want to battle mook solomon wants to battle mook math wants to battle mook hell dna wants to battle mook like what every, would you everyone do want to battle mook man i don't know man i just i just bring my a game like i do with every battle you know what i'm saying man just bring my a game hope for the best man that's that's about it I have a question. Do you think Mook is everything he says he is, or do you think he's hype? Uh, man, Mook is definitely one of, like, the originators, I think, with the battling. You know what I'm saying? Like, he was one of the first dude to get all them hits. and So you put him on the same level as Jen? As Jen? Yeah. Um, Jen is dope, but I don't really put him up there anymore. Like, his Freestyle Friday battles was dope, but, um, you know what I'm saying? I think... No offense to Jen, I think he kind of fell off just a little bit. You know what I'm saying? No offense Spoken to him. He's still, a, he's still a talented dude. <laughs> My man said he fell off a lot. <laughs> oh, but, so you uh, think he'd be able to take Jen out? Uh, yo, I mean, a lot of grind time guys have been asking for him. Like, I remember My disaster. man, Disaster, yeah. Disaster, disaster wants to battle him back. hard. I don't think, I don't think Jen won a battle anymore, to be honest, man. Like, you know what I'm saying? I think he's just focused on his whole, like, music thing and just grinding, man. Well, yeah, I mean, uh, lost a sol like he first lost a series, then he lost a Solomon. Cause I know in uh, you know what I'm saying where he's from, like he got a name out there, man. He got his own clothing line and everything. So, I mean, I don't think like the battling is gonna really benefit him anymore. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, he's like a Chinese Jay Z right now. <laughs> I guess, yeah, man. I guess, yeah, that's, that's, that's a good... Like, I remember him back when I was in Hunter College, and Hunter College Studios in that production room just spitting rhymes endlessly, yeah. all day, all night, just spitting, spitting, spitting. That's what that guy did. But um, I want to thank you for coming on the show, Complex. Nah, I thank, I thank y'all for real, man. I appreciate the love, yo. Thanks for having me once again. You know what I'm saying? Much sure. love to y'all. I'll be sure to get you that fruit basket with the with the coupon for the pedicure. Ah, uh, just no hotel rooms. So. No, no hotel room. Ah, right, cool, cool. Pause. <laughs> pause. Pause. Please, Klaus. That's a lot of pause right there. Well, I give good fruit basket. Hey, <laughs> pause. <laughs> that's a big pause right there, oh man. My God. He I, said, "I get." That's a stop button. <laughs> that's not even a pause no more. That's yeah, a that's stop button. button. <laughs> I hope, I hope Complex's opponent is not listening right now. <laughs> well, it has kiwis and, and kumquats and pineapple. Pause! <laughs> wow, man, that's crazy. Pause, pause, pause. <laughs> All right, so we got one more track to play for you. So um, what, what track do you want to hear? What, um, track, what track do you want the listeners to... Uh, I figure since we playing all remixes and stuff, so uh, I got the Beamer Benz and Bentley remix. I, I'm, I'm gonna put it out there. I think I got the best version, man. Oh, straight up of, the, of that song. Like I'm gonna throw it out there. Better than the Nissan Honda Chevy. Yo, one. Joel killed it. You know what I'm saying? But I think my version just goes hard, man. You know what oh, I'm saying? Whoa. Much respect to everyone, but yo, I killed that track. So that's on the mixtape coming out too. The why, why you mad volume one? So definitely, hopefully y'all like it. You know what I'm saying? Give me your honest opinion afterwards too. Definitely, we will. We will. So once again, shout outs. Uh, you know, shout outs to Grind Time East Coast. Grind shout Time East Coast URL. Smack all them, man. What up, man? Yeah, definitely. I'll be seeing you on uh, March twenty sixth. Is um when when my the boy URL Complex, battle is. Yeah, yeah, that's when the URL battle is. Is when my boy Complex is gonna go in and uh, show Detroit why New York pimps these eight mile hoes. That's what we do, right? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, I guess so. That's what we do. <laughs> I, guess, I, guess. <laughs> I mean, like, I mean, come on, man. That, that's like prime material right there. <laughs> Put, call eight, call I eight might mile. have to use that in my third round, man. Yeah, eight, mile, eight miles like a prostitute strip. 
<laughs> For real, man. I come up with jokes. I could I can't rhyme them together. It's unfortunate, but that wasn't a joke. That was just dirty. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I think that was kind of true. Yeah, that wasn't even. Well, listen. class would know. Oh, <laughs> yes, I would know. Shots fired, yo! Shots fired. I mean, that's. Yeah. A, I mean, look, yeah. class, class has been all around the world. He's done reprehensible things in just about every state. Uh, looking like Cheddar Bob. <laughs> 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 Klaus is no Cheddar Bob. He knows how to aim a gun. Cheddar Bob. Oh man, I'm the one blushing now. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that was funny. All right, full factor. You got it ready. You got it crying. <laughs> you got it ready, full factor. Oh all right, God. that's the Beamer Benz of Bentley remix by Complex. Thank you for coming on Rated R Radio. Shit, shit, Brooklyn Radio, man, Complex. We out, man. All right, we'll be right back with Klaus's Corner. More Rated R Radio coming up next. Full fact to drop it down. Let's go. Yeah. Uh-huh. The official club bullies about to put this building on tilt. Leaning on is when I'm riding on these buses. It be crowded, so I'm bugging because I'm trying not to touch them. But I'm dying just to stuff them because I'm lying. If I wasn't spying, I didn't know the honeys because I'm dying to just... Rap is cock a duty, so I'm cocking back the Uzi And I'm shooting at you boozies, cause you rap like Ratatouille A fraction of your groupies say you acting like a movie So I'm clapping when I'm shooting, cause I'm action like a movie Oh, amigo, we ain't equal, you feeble fecal That see through, I beat you evil, ego like ego, Logan Regal